Well, hello there, and welcome back to Corbin Does Something. Uh, today, I am going to introduce you to the selfie ring light. So, like, I wanted a ring light because I wanted to be a professional YouTuber. Um, this one was like 30 bucks. It'll hold a tablet and a phone. I think the phone I could probably pop out and put a camera in there. Um, if not, I can adjust my camera tripod to go shoot through this. So, um, just better lighting helps everybody. So, I want to take a look at this and see. Ooh, I give a little thank you card here. That's so pleasant of them. Uh, thank you for your purchase. More for you. Scan to join the VIP service group. Okay. So, if I'm unhappy, I can send this back. That's cool. And I should tell my friends about Corbin Does Something. So make sure that you're telling your friends that you're liking, commenting, and subscribing today. Um, um, I am really hoping that this comes out to be a good product. One thing that I might end up doing with this uh, for St. Corbin's Day is setting up a cheap little photo booth. And I think this might help me with that. And and, and that's still kind of a uh, an idea that's just floating in my head. If I do it, I'll show you how I do it. But let's uh, take a look at this. This is um, a thing. You don't say. How does thou art work? I don't want to break it, so I'm going to tighten that back up. Here are some instructions. I'm going to put that there. What are you, my friend? Oh, a little clicker. I, I actually have one of these. It's a little, this is a, a little Bluetooth thing, and you press the button and it takes a picture. I actually, I think that'd be cool to remap that to something else other than take a picture. So, this must be the cell phone holder. Or is this, this, no, this has got to be a tablet holder, right? Maybe? How do you, does this, does this open up? I don't know how this is supposed to work. It certainly looks like it, I don't know. We'll figure that one out. Figure it and out. You figure it out. This it is out. the thing that goes on that. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. All right. So this thing claps around here. All right, whatever. We'll put that to the side. This is all garbage here. And just put the garbage into this box. And now we have the actual ring light here. Okay. Oh, I have one of these. These are actually really nice. I, uh, I have uh, essentially this set up for my overhead camera. So that's pretty cool. Alright. The ones I have are better quality, I think. Let's just open it up. Okay. Alright. So I'm I'm already seeing a couple problems here. And I don't know if this is gonna work the way that I want it to. That's what she said. I, I might have to figure something else out for this. This seems pretty small too. That's what she said. I really don't think a phone can fit in it. Like this doesn't adjust, it doesn't look like. Like what what are they expecting here? Does it adjust? Okay, so here's the product overview. Oh, there's the, that switch. Okay. Now I'm wondering Well, would this be able to go on here? Because it might be cooler. That might be too big. That's what she said. Is that too big? That's about the same size, I think. Yeah. So I can I can put this on here. Oh well. Now it's got two of those, but I can put th that on there and use this as the tablet holder, I guess. I don't know. Let me undo that. We'll, we'll set it up right. 
The problem is, is I can't really do it with a uh, with a camera, but I can just set the camera inside of this, so that wouldn't be an issue. So this is on here. That's good. That's the way that it should be. Okay. And this gets plugged in through a USB, so I have to find me a cord for my USB. And as I say that, I didn't turn on any of my lights, my, my regular diffuser lights. So let me get this. Well, we will stand it up first. Okay, so how does this go? It looks like... I broke it. Put that back on there. Supposedly, there we go. Okay, so these spread out. Oh, okay, cool. All right. That's neat. Let's tighten that up so it doesn't move. That's a little weird, but I like it. That's what she said. All right, and oh, that goes up really high. Oh, how high do you go? All the way up there, eh? Okay, so now... Okay, so let's just turn a bunch of knobs. Alright. Huh? We're going to set this. Oh, there's no, like, this doesn't turn. So I have to spin this whole thing around. So, that's kind of annoying. Alright. But it didn't wrap that nicely around there. I'm wondering. Oh! I can take this off. I could put a camera right on here. That's really cool. Okay, so I can use it the way that I thought. That's cool. I like that. Uh, let me go ahead and plug her in. Alright, so I have it plugged in. My, my cord's a little far, far away, so I'm going to struggle here. This is actually half lit up, so that's weird. Um, it looks like the power button lights up, but it's accidentally illuminating other parts. So let's hit the power button. Fuck! That's bright. Wow, that's that's a really bright light. Okay, let's see. What does this do? Oh, I didn't know it changes temperature. There's a lot in there, and you can see how like my skin changes too. Um, I'm a big fan of bright white, so I think I'll leave it at that. There's a plus and minus sign on here. I can dim it. Okay, that is really neat. Really, really neat. Alright guys, I now have the ring light set up there, and just so you can see, this is how it is with it off. Now, let's turn it back on. So, uh, if there is a light that you use at, at, for your videos, or uh, any any light information that you have out there, you know, leave, leave a comment below letting me know what you like to use. I was using these. Looks like a ghost, right? Uh, so this is a very thin sheet, or well, pillowcase, that I use as a diffuser, and it actually works really well. Inside here, I'll show you, is a light bar. I have these uh, installed on the tops of my walls. They give me excellent lighting. Um, you may have seen them in the background of some of my older videos. This helps diffuse that light because it is super bright and super annoying. You're, you're um, one to talk. And you can see this is made uh, with a zip tie holding this to an old broken lamp. This is one of those stand-up lamps. Uh, it stops working and it makes a great base. Because these are only on for a short period of time, I'm not worried about too hot, but at the same time, these lights don't really get hot. They're amazing. These are Barrington. It's like 60 bucks, I think, for eight of these lights. They can work in sequence together. You can get a little string to connect them, or you can just use one at a time. That's about all I got. If you liked the video, again, let me know in the comments below. And then also, what kind of light system do you have? Because this is what I, what I have. Again, very cheap. These were leftover pieces with broken lamps. So, yeah, I'm in... And I'm a genius. I know. Mom, aren't you proud? I'm a very stable genius. Yeah. All right. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell notification. And if you need help subscribing, there's a video for that. Thank you, guys. Have an awesome day. You like me yet?